can never ever find the right words and there's no way this is real life there's no telling you hey guys welcome back to we're back to another video today uh unfortunately we we're not able to get the wheels and tires mounted uh we'll be pushing that off just one more day but meantime, maybe it's done for a reason because we're gonna try to wrap as much of the car as possible, if not entirely. So we wanna do the entire quarter panels, side skirts, trunk, and maybe even rear bumper. The only thing we're not gonna be trying to accomplish, hopefully in this video, hopefully accomplish all of that. Um, it's just the front bumper. I do wanna sand it down. It's in horrific condition and I do not wanna wrap over that. I'm probably actually gonna be sanding it down removing the bumper and uh, wrapping it while I'm doing the intercooler as well. So you're gonna be adding the big intercooler, the biggest intercooler you could possibly add to this car, custom painted everything for burger tuning, take off the bumper, wrap it, sand it, do all that good stuff to it, and that's gonna be the finishing touches to the front end. But meantime, let's see if we can get the rest of this thing wrapped up. Also guys, for those of you guys who didn't watch the last video, we have the new merch drops. We got a bunch of new goodies. Uh, I'm gonna throw in a little quick little cinematic that I had in the last video. So for those of you guys who already watched it, you can skip it if you like, but I mean, it's pretty badass. I would watch it one more time. channel that would help so much and at the same time guys every ten dollars spent will get you guys one entry toward a carbon fiber lip or a carbon fiber spoiler depending on what car you guys have we will get you what you need for your car and if you spend forty dollars or more you will get free shipping tracking all the good stuff plus four entries because every ten dollars gets you one entry towards the giveaway so not bad. Anywho, let's just start uh, start wrapping the, the 135. I think we're all excited for it. We really want to get this thing done with, and uh, we can start doing a bunch of mods, like wheels, engine upgrades. This thing's already pushing some pretty intense numbers, but we want to get the 550 on the dyno. That's the goal. 500 to 550 on the dyno is what we're looking for. So at least in the in the near future, we might might try to go a little bit more send. A lot more send. We'll see, we'll see. Anywho, all right guys, time to get some things off the car like tail lights, gas cap door, and uh, just start cleaning everything down and get it ready for wrap. I know a lot of you guys are kind of disappointed that it's copper, but uh, I'm telling you guys, just wait for the two cars to be next to each other. You guys are gonna love it. Just have faith in your man. I've never disappointed you guys. Have faith in me, come on. All right, let's get these tail lights out. I think that's the first thing we have to do. Destiny brought us together, but then we messed it up. Alright guys, so we just finished the gas cap. I might actually remove all these decals. The white and the black is a little too much. I might actually put either copper decals or black decals. But the black and copper is really coming together. This door handle is kind of sticking out like a sore thumb. So I might actually end up wrapping that. We'll have to see. I just need the side skirt to be wrapped, some wheels on it, and that also be smoked out. And we'll see once the whole car is finished of course, so we'll see if that's either a compliment or that might need to get deleted. As for the mirrors, I'm definitely keeping them black. 
all the trim is black, which is perfect. The roof is originally black, so that is absolutely gorgeous. Really coming together, I'm super happy with it. Everything came out perfect on this side, so I think it's time to go knock out the other quarter panel, and then we're gonna do both side skirts right back to back. Me and my brother don't like to knock out an entire side and then knock out an and the other entire side, mainly because when you do one entire side, you kinda know how the car looks now, so you don't really have a motivation to do the other side, so when you do both quarters, you're like, okay, I just done this quarter, now let's go do the other quarter so we can finally do the side skirt so we can finally see the whole side. It's kinda like it keeps us kinda motivated. Anywho, uh, um, let's go ahead and get to the other side and uh, start cutting out and doing the quarter panel. That's the last big piece on the car. All right guys, we are knocking out this car literally chunk by chunk. So, uh, we're gonna go ahead and check out this side. This side is completely wrapped up. Quarter panel, side skirt, fender, door. Uh, pretty much everything here is done. Even the gas cap, which looks so good. So coming around from back here, guys, I don't know if you guys see the vision, but with the wheels that I have sitting right back there, whether you guys saw that in the video or not, um, I have wheels for this car. It's gonna make this thing look so good. It's gonna complement it so nicely. These decals, I love them. I'm definitely gonna put on uh, the hashtag save a BMW. And I'm definitely gonna put back on the burger tuning, but I think I'm gonna have to make my own. I might make some copper uh, decals here, or maybe just some black ones, some low key ones, either or. I think it's gonna look super sick, or maybe ones that match the wheels because it's not copper and it's not black. So, that all being said, we do need to still wrap the trunk and the bumper, but today, uh, me and my brother have things to do. This is literally the day after you guys you guys saw the last video, so we actually have to go do some things with the fam, uh, and this, this trunk's gonna take a lot of time. We're gonna have to remove the spoiler, which takes a lot of time to remove and clean. Uh, we have to remove the emblem, again, takes time to remove and clean. You have to get the trunk, so we got to remove this tail light because we like to do it properly, and then uh, obviously remove the plates and the rest of that stuff. And then also doing the rear bumper, we have to move the tail lights again, remove the diffuser, and uh, it, it's it's a process to do this rear stuff, even though we can definitely do it. Uh, we'll probably knock this out on the same video that we're gonna be doing the wheels. I'm literally trying to knock out as much as possible. On this side, we did do the quarter panel, and we did do the side skirts. My brother's just wrapping that up down there, and literally, and it, it's gonna be perfect. I cannot wait for the wheels to go on, guys. These wheels are just so hideous. I don't even know why BMW even released these things, but uh, anywho, let me know also, guys, if you guys wanna see, because I love the copper with the black. It looks so good. Should I wrap the interior? interior wood trim with copper. Let me know down below guys, like, check this out. I think it's gonna look super good in the interior. Um, just a little bit of compliments uh, because it's pretty much, it's all blacked out in here. So I think a little bit of copper in here might actually complement the car very nicely. So let me know what you guys think down below. Pretty much a black and copper theme. Uh, I went ahead, already placed Nord on those turn signals. They are coming in, again, the wheels are. The bumper, let me show you guys why I, I, like, I'm delaying the bumper. We definitely need some grills. The previous owner painted these grills. I don't know if you guys can see them. They're in terrible shape. Uh, that is that. Uh, the bumper right here, as you guys can see, terrible paint peel uh, right here as well. Here is just, oh my God, horrendous. It's definitely gonna get sanded down completely all around the front. If I wanna wrap this and be, I could just wrap this, but it's gonna be a shit job, so I wanna make sure I take the bumper off, sand it down, wrap it properly. I wanna wrap this, but it's gonna be a poor job, so uh, yeah. Anyhow, uh, we'll go ahead and get that done, hopefully in the near future. I'm gonna go ahead and place an order on two black grills. Uh, guys, let me know, do you think this blue emblem is looking good with just the copper? I think it looks good, it's just right now the black bumper is throwing it off, so once we have that wrapped up, it's gonna look proper. And guys, check out the top, the black group, oh, OEM, the Save a BMW Air Fresh. And if you guys want to cop those to support your man, cop those right there. Those are honestly so sick. Black mirrors already. I don't even have to wrap them, which I'm super happy about. Black trim, black door handles. Guys, this car's really coming together. All right, my brother's gonna go ahead and just finish up that side skirt. I got a lot of cleaning up to do for me. My brother have to head out, so. Oh, you guys may have seen the wheels in that shot right there. Just a hint. All right, I'm gonna put you on full time off, so I gotta clean up a lot of stuff around here.
All right, guys, the so garage is cleaned up. Copper, the baby copper is in the garage right now. Hopefully we get that rear end done pretty soon. Um, but yeah, cars are back in the garage. Uh, Ocean's just chilling there, being a good girl. All my cars have been treating me fairly well recently, so that's why I'm showing them a lot of love. I actually have the money to show them love because they're not taking poops on me. But then again, I think it's because I did all the maintenance. Maybe you guys should do your maintenance if you don't have BMW issues. But then, you know, that's a lot of money. I don't know, don't buy a BMW, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> um, thankfully, after doing all the maintenance on all my cars, they all seem pretty good. I mean, for the F435, did literally everything. For the 135, literally everything other than a valve cover. I might need one, even though the receipts show that it's already had one. I don't really know how that works. The 535, I did a good amount of maintenance, but not as much as I did with the other car. So we might have to dig into some maintenance on that. But then again, performance, per we, we gotta get to some performance. I mean, come on guys. We've been seeing a lot of uh, aesthetics on the channel. We need we need a five or 600 horsepower build. And that is what I'm expecting out of this in the near future. And the 435, because I love them both. I just want to treat them both right. It's kind of so hard. I'm gonna have a problem. And don't forget to cop some merch to support your boy. Everything you guys cop will be put towards the builds and also my future goal that's in December. You guys will hopefully see it. It's absolutely insane. It's, it's like, it's literally a dream of mine. And if we can get this on the channel, it's gonna be absolutely insane. More vlogs with that particular car, of course. Probably the biggest engine I've ever had in my life. So it, I've never had a, an engine like that. So. Support your guys. Come on, support your boy, support your boy. Copy your merch down below. Tag me on Instagram once you guys do. I'll repost literally everyone that purchases anything. Without further ado, guys, I love y'all so much. Remember to stay humble. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. She got me saying, Yalla, huh, baby. I need you to see me. Quit with the front and then put your guard down, girl. We know you ain't easy. She got me saying, Yalla, huh, baby. I need you to see me. Quit with the front and then put your door down, girl, we know you ain't easy, you